copyright claim. The day of my birthday, March 28th, we got a copyright claim for Fonda Stella, Bohemian Rhapsody. So all the money that we made prior to the claim went to us, but everything that we make from now on is going to go to the corporation who claimed the video. We'll react to Kang Kyun Woo, one of the four members of Fonda Stella. He's going to sing Phantom of the Opera, an amazing song that we have reacted two, three or four times. And what's interesting is, he's alone. He's going to sing both the male and the female part. And what I said earlier about Forestella content is because when we posted our Forestella reaction, her channel kind of exploded. Before that, we had problem getting view from Korea because I think people have trouble understanding us. That his name appears here. That translate all of our Forestella video and it bring a lot of view. And these people then go see our other video that is not related to Forestella but still Korean. So we get a big boost for our channel. If any of you want to translate any of our video, please do. It's helping us a lot to get traffic on our channel. And you can then suggest us something and we will do it. We cannot pay you your core, but we can, we can do your suggestion. Okay, no more talking. We try to do this intro outside. Not sure how it's gonna go. So, Kang Kyun Hu, Petal of Opera. Are you ready? Yes! Let's get started. interesting because he's making that version not too dark or creepy mm -hmm. which is good sometimes but I think with him and the way he look he make him very like engaging but like soft and a little bit mysterious so it, I think his interpretation is different from what we have heard exactly his look is like that so he need to make the song fit with his look too I think making the stuff a little bit more personal I would yeah. say so I'm curious to see what they're gonna do next once again with me Change. Tempo change. Tempo change. They change the the music. It went from a bit loud to almost quiet. You can hear uh -huh. someone. It's like... Can I hear someone walking almost to go terrorize the singer? Because he's doing opposite of what I thought he was gonna do with the song. I thought he was gonna explode a lot and he's making it really on the storytelling. Yeah. He's telling the story in a very interesting and personal ways. I'm impressed by the delivery, the interpretation of what he's doing.
doing it. Yeah, we watch Nightwish. Yeah, I mean, we want super vocal singing yeah, that yeah. song. We watch many different singers. But um, usually the music is gonna be loud and they're gonna sing like in the group. But this one, he's alone. He made this like more soft, but it's still beautiful with a good story. Like you need to follow him every day. Yeah, he's playing both character yeah. and it's like a conversation between both character. Working at this performance, I thought it was really unique. Kyun Ho. So next time you. I need to remember him. Kang Kyun Ho, yes. He has kind of a K pop look a little bit with the short hair. Well, <laughs> yeah. I've seen all of them. Kang Kyun Ho. So next time there's three more in the group, recommend us a song from one of the other three. Yeah. We want to be able to work. Now we recognize him as Kang Kyun Ho, the guy who thinks I know of the opera and would like to react to the other three individually so we can really get used to the, their name and the four member. So when we react to them as a group later on, we'll be able to really recognize. Name, be, name them by their name and not just oh the guy that is as a bass voice or the guy that sing it like Dimash you know we want to be able to name them and know him a little bit we will watch also some English interview from them we want to know them more it's, it's easier to react and to bring more information if we know a little bit about their background and who they are yeah thank you for watching everyone kamsamnida namnam eya namnam sila dadam hey kamsamnida sarankeyo okay see you next time everyone bye bye <laughs>